and one in the ring of Bobo Brazil. Again, it's so very difficult for us to call this, Norm. There was so much going on. The entire locker room is emptied up. Uh, Buck Lawless has blood everywhere trickling down the backside of his arm. Well, there's been so much uh, rubble in the ring off the ropes. And look at that. Boot into the midsection. Oh, DDT he's rolling up past rolls the him over. He got Oh, my him. gosh. Jerry Graham. Dr. Jerry Graham has just pinned Bastard Payne. He got him. Amazing. Jerry Graham got the pinfall on Pastor Payne. DDT roll up combo. Oh my gosh, absolutely amazing. Martino Angelo would have been very, very proud tonight. Wherever he's at, he's got to be looking down on Jerry Graham. Jerry Graham Jr., the winner of this match. Amazing, Norm. Absolutely amazing what we have seen here. And maybe we can say that the Kentucky Wrecking Crew has finally been vanquished here in the WWE. And look at that arm on the backside of... Uh-oh. Uh Uh-oh. We got two guys that are not happy with each other. Shoving each other back and forth. This may have finally broken down. There's blood everywhere. A lot now, of it's Pastor Payne's. Now we've seen dissension between these two before. Oh! And now Alcatraz hitting Pastor Payne. Alcatraz just decked Pastor Payne. This is not over. Well, I think if we were looking for the uh, there is no way the breakup of the Wrecking Crew. It's just happened. Look at this. Alcatraz has tackled Buck Lawless. There is no way Pastor Payne can put this back together. No way. Ladies and gentlemen, give me some room, please. Give me some room to escort him out. Alcatraz is being escorted out. We're seeing all sorts of wrestlers taking, taking Alcatraz to the back. Still not even sure what to make of everything here at this point. But that may be the end. Of the Kentucky Wrecking Crew. I think crew. that's the last we will see of the Kentucky Wrecking Crew as a functional unit here in the WWA. But boy, I was that Pastor Payne splitting, uh, spitting blood out everywhere. Oh my gosh, there is so much wreckage in the ring. But what it boils down to is your winners, Norm, Andy Shane, Bobo Brazil, and Dr. Jerry Graham. And make sure you check out WWASuperstarWrestling.com for all the latest and what this may mean for January the 3rd. I never thought I would see the breakup of one of the most dominant tag teams in WWA history, the Kentucky Wrecking Crew, beating superstars up left and right for the last six months, and now they are at each other's throats. And on January 3rd, former tag team partners are going to face off with each other. Buck Lawless on one side of the ring, on the other side, his former partner, Alcatraz. Whoa, 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 whoa. First of all, I didn't have a partner. Anybody who knows anything knows that I was the Kentucky Wrecking Crew. Me, carried it on my own. You know what I'm saying? I was the one in there leasing out all the pain. I was the one in there that everybody was like, oh my God, get that man out of there. Because once a juggernaut enters that ring and that bell sounds, I take over control. From the penitentiary to the ring, I am in control. Get that right. Every single match, who dominated the match? Me. Who cost us the match? This guy, Buck Lawless. Lawless, you want to know something? Come this show, I hope you said goodbye to your kids, kiss your wife goodnight, because you're going to be in the hospital from now on. Because everybody knows, once you step in the ring with Alcatraz, first, you're intimidated. Second, you're dominated. And last but not least, they're always violated. I'm not even sure if we're going to be able to find an official who's going to be able to uh, take charge of that matchup. It is going to happen. Former tag team partners facing off against each other. The breakup of the Kentucky Wrecking Crew is going to happen January 3rd at Somerset Hall. The Kentucky Wrecking Crew is one of the most dominant tag teams I have ever seen all throughout the entire world. But believe it or not, the members of the Kentucky Wrecking Crew can't stand each other anymore. So what's going to happen January 3rd at Somerset Hall? Former tag team partners collide. Alcatraz is going to take on Buck Lawless. And in Buck Lawless's corner, the former manager of the Kentucky Wrecking Crew, Pastor Payne.
Let me tell you something, Alcatraz. You might be able to lift a ton, but you couldn't spell a ton, because you know what? We don't need you in the Kentucky Wrecking Crew, because you know what? We have the Kentucky Wrecker right here, Buck Lawless. We are the Kentucky Wrecking Crew by ourselves, because we have the big man, Buck Lawless. And coming up January 3rd at Somerset Hall, you are going to find out why he is the Kentucky Wrecker. Certainly, Pastor Payne feels very confident in the abilities of Buck Lawless. We will see Buck Lawless taking on Alcatraz, former tag team partners battle January 3rd at Somerset Hall.